Elon Musk just revealed a brand new humanoid robot. This is part of his campaign to change the public's perception of the firm as more than just an electric vehicle manufacturer. A little more than a year ago, during Tesla's inaugural AI day, Mr. Musk initially outlined the ambition for the robot, Optimus. To many surprise, a costumed dancer appeared on stage in its place. This time around, Mr. Musk displayed a prototype that was much more than just a costume. The early prototype, whose cables were still visible, took a few steps, waved to the audience, and performed some basic dance moves. Mr. Musk joked that the robot was limited in its actions, out of concern that it would fall on its face. So the robot can actually do a lot more than we just showed you, we just didn't want it to fall on its face. Elon also mentioned that the robot's appearance on stage was the first time that it functioned untethered. Our goal is to make a useful humanoid robot as quickly as possible, he said, with the aspiration of being able to make them at a high volume and low cost. It is expected to cost much less than a car, he said, with the price point below $20,000. He also mentioned that customers should be able to receive the robot once ordered within three to five years. Unfortunately for you, the robot is not yet for sale. Later on, he displayed a sleeker, non-functional model that he claimed looked closer to the final product. There's still a lot of work to be done to refine Optimus, he said, that the concept could evolve over time. It won't be boring. Tesla stated that the battery-powered robot should be able to perform challenging tasks, such as lifting large objects. Mr. Musk noted that it would have conversational abilities and protections to prevent the machine from committing crime. Come on, Jack, you're gonna like the... I am a firm believer in AI safety, said Mr. Musk, who has previously voiced reservations about the potential applications of such technology. He stated that he believes the government should have a regulating authority. The Tesla CEO envisioned Optimus assisting his company in producing cars more efficiently, beginning with simple jobs and expanding to the more complex applications. He has also indicated that the robot might potentially serve a wider range of purposes and ease labor shortages. At Tesla's annual shareholder meeting, Elon stated, It will, I think, turn the whole notion of what's an economy on its head, at the point at which you have no shortage of labor. He added, It really is a fundamental transformation of civilization as we know it. When he first unveiled the Optimus concept, Mr. Musk said that a robot could have such an impact on the labor market, it could make it necessary to provide universal basic income or a stipend to people without strings attached. Tesla has also experienced difficulties with automation. Initial efforts to rely largely on automated tools to scale up vehicle manufacturing failed and the corporation was forced to rely on factory workers to a greater extent than anticipated. Later, Mr. Musk tweeted, Yes, excessive automation at Tesla was a mistake. To be precise, my mistake. Humans are underrated. Chris Atkinson, a professor of robotics at Carnegie Mellon University, stated that the primary function of Tesla's humanoid robot is one of the most intriguing aspects of the machine. If Tesla's primary objective is to improve manufacturing, a quadruped would have been easier to construct than a humanoid robot because additional legs would make balancing easier. Mr. Musk, who was key in popularizing electric vehicles and whose company SpaceX pioneered the landing of rocket boosters, also has a history of making bold predictions that do not instantly come true. Three years ago, he predicted during an event about automation that more than one million Tesla vehicles would be ready to operate without a driver by the middle of 2020, positioning the firm to start a robot taxi service. That has not yet occurred. Mr. Musk has stated for some time that Tesla aspires to be more than just a car manufacturer, and he reinforced this point on Friday. He described the business as a series of startups. As he did last year, Mr. Musk promoted the most recent event as one designed to recruit engineers in sectors such as artificial intelligence, robots, and computer chips. Tesla has traditionally relied on automation to maintain its competitive advantage. The company's automobiles are equipped with an advanced driver assistance technology known as Autopilot, 
which assists drivers with tasks such as keeping a safe distance from other vehicles on the road and maintaining lane position. At the recent event, engineers from Tesla described a portion of the artificial intelligence work that the business is performing, including the foundation for its driver assistance technologies. Mr. Musk stated that Tesla's creation of a powerful AI-focused computer might enable the company to give the number-crunching capabilities as a service to others, similar to cloud computing offerings provided by Amazon. The business is also developing and selling an improved version of Autopilot that enables more automated driving in cities. Tesla names the system Full Self Driving, or FSD, despite the fact that it does not truly make vehicles autonomous and the company instructs drivers to maintain their hands on the steering wheel at all times. Tesla also announced that it now has 160,000 customers using the FSD software. Mr. Musk stated that the expansion of the technology beyond the United States and Canada is contingent on regulatory permission, but it should be technically achievable by the end of the year. Tesla has continually increased the price of FSD, which now costs $15,000. Tesla's efforts to build more advanced driver assistant features and eventually completely autonomous vehicles have been driven by their continued investment in artificial intelligence. Tesla stated that the software utilized to perform more driving functions also supports Optimus, the humanoid robot. Tesla's pursuit of automation has become increasingly scrutinized. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, which governs auto safety, launched an investigation into autopilot last year after a string of incidents involving Teslas that collided with emergency responder vehicles stopped along the road. Two US senators have also requested that the Federal Trade Commission investigate whether Tesla's marketing of autopilot and FSD was fraudulent. The manufacturer of electric vehicles has long maintained that driving with autopilot is safer than driving without it. Tesla has internal data indicating that accidents were less frequent when autopilot was used while other researchers have disputed the company's methods. There's no question that Tesla is attempting to push the boundaries of AI, but what will be the short-term harm of their long-term goals? Let us know down in the comments below, and if you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn notifications on so you can be informed in every business conversation.